Okay, this is just like heaven. So the first line is just the left hand. It's A, 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 E, 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 B, 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 D, B, 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 D. And the root the counting on it is one, two. On the next line, the left hand does the same thing, but the right hand plays a tenth above it. So it's A and C sharp on, uh, we're talking about bar five, A and C sharp. Then B and G sharp. B and D. D and F sharp. So the counting is like this. One. Two, three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and On the next uh, line, bar nine, the right hand has chords. The left hand is still doing the same thing, but the right hand chords are E, A, and C sharp. That's an A major chord. A major is A, C sharp, and E, but the E's on the bottom. So it's A major to E major, E, G sharp, and B. Then B minor with F sharp on the bottom. F sharp, B, and D. B minor is B, D, F sharp usually, but F sharp's on the bottom. And D major is usually D, F sharp, and A. Or I don't know if it's usually, but that's a root position. We put the A on the bottom. Counting with both hands here is one, 